One of the main reasons why people love iPhone so much is because of iMessage, the inbuilt messaging app which comes with iPhones. But did you know that apart from sending memojis and sending stickers, you can also play games with your contacts on iMessage? Well, in this video, I'm going to give you all the steps you need on how to install games on your iMessage app and make the conversations more playful. Pun intended. Are you listening? Damn. Hi guys, welcome to another edition of Cyber Reviews. And today I'm going to show you how you can make conversations more exciting on your iPhone. Now, if you're new to my channel, I make entertaining app reviews, mobile phone reviews, and affordable gadget reviews to help you make an informed decision whenever you are making your next purchase. So if you like that kind of content, please click on the subscribe button and turn on all notifications so you don't miss the next one. Okay, so to begin, you need an iPhone, but not just an iPhone. You need an iPhone running iOS 11 and above. Next, start a conversation or continue any conversation with any of your contacts on iMessage. Scroll through the options you find on top of your keyboard and click on the store icon. This will open up a special version of the App Store that exclusively shows extensions for your iMessage app. Most of these are stickers, but if you scroll down, you will find a section called iMessage Games We Love. Tap the See All button next to the title to see the full list of iMessage games. You will be presented with a full list of the games available for iMessage. Now, each of these games has its own page where you can check out the pictures, videos, and other information about the game. You can browse through and find the one you like. Now you download it like you download any app on the App Store. There are many types but the most popular is Game Pigeon and it is popular for a good reason. It comes with so many game types but more on that later. Once you find the one that you are most interested in, download it and it will be installed as an extension on your iMessage app. When you return to your iMessage screen, on top of the keyboard, you'll see the game you installed. You can install multiple games. Most of the games are free but have in-app purchases to unlock special items and game modes. Now one thing I really love is that there are no ads on any of the games I've downloaded and played so far. So click on the game icon on top of your keyboard and this will open a menu where you can customize the game you want to play with your contact. When you have selected a game type, it will be automatically loaded into your keyboard as if you were sending a photo. Your game will say deliver just like a regular message. After you have completed your turn, you would have to wait for your friend to play because this is a turn based game. Whenever your opponent is able to complete their turn, you would receive a new message from them with the game preview. Tap it to open the game and to continue your next turn. Now let me tell you some of my personal favorites. I love word games. So anagrams is really cool to play. With anagrams, you form words out of a given set of letters in a minute. Then word hunt is also another favorite of mine, where you need to swipe on a given set of letters in a 4x4 grid to create words out of those letters within a given period, usually a minute. The games I don't really like or I don't really do well at that people keep winning are the games which require me to flick my fingers on the screen because Charlie, me, I have some crooked fingers so I find it difficult to win these games. Such games include cap pong, basketball and darts. Now another game I really come to love is four in a row where you need to place tiles on the board in all directions in an attempt to link four of the same color tiles. The first person to do so wins. Now apart from playing iMessage games with one person, you can actually play some of the games in group chats and because I'm a very competitive person, I love to win all the time. Now let me tell you one reason why I love iMessage games so much. Sometimes when you're having a conversation, especially if you're like a guy who has met a lady for the first time and you are trying to, you know, toast her and stuff like that, and you run out of ideas on what to say, instead of going to ask silly questions like, is your dog poisonous or is your mommy a woman? You can just load up an iMessage game and then you play and as you play, you know, you'll be able to think about what next you want to see and keep the conversation going like iMessage has saved a lot of relationships which would have ended on the very very first day.
if you would like to play any iMessage game with me, please hit me up on Instagram. Now, if you've enjoyed this video, please, it will be a crime for you to just leave without pressing the like button. So I'm waiting, just click on the like button and share it as well if you really, really enjoyed it. And of course, if you're new to my channel, please click on the subscribe button, turn on all notifications so you don't miss the next episode. Thanks for playing.